everyone, I'm Mayor Hillary Sheevy. Wasn't that an incredible performance by Billinghurst Middle School? Tonight we come together to celebrate our 152nd birthday with you. We want to celebrate the arts, the culture in our community, but most importantly, we want to celebrate all of you. So let's check out our partners over at Renown and see what they're doing for our frontline workers to let them know we appreciate them. Our performing arts community is absolutely incredible. A big piece of that is our music scene. Now let's go to Damani Ranch High School. Oh, oh, oh. 
We stood together and closed our theaters on March 13th, 2020 to keep our artists, families and communities healthy. We communicate together and call ourselves G3. We collaborate because we believe in the power and healing of art and storytelling. In light of our theaters being closed, Goodluck Macbeth, Bruca Theatre and Reno Little Theatre have come together to create virtual content on our YouTube channel, Ghostlight TV. We collaborate because art is an essential part of all our lives. We present virtual interviews, performances, poetry, and other exciting events to keep you involved and connected. We collaborate because we're stronger together. The spirit of theater is not confined to the four walls of a building, nor does its capacity for connecting us cease when our theaters are closed. It persists. We collaborate because our solidarity creates renewed purpose and enduring hope. We are storytellers. We believe in the power of connection. We are a Reno Theater community collaboration. We are Ghostlight TV. In times like these, we really appreciate our community coming together, like groups like Wash Your Hands, Mask Across Nevada, and Reno Sparks Mutual Aid. We couldn't be more proud of all your service and giving back to our community. Thank you. At its core, Mutual Aid Group is a voluntary reciprocal exchange of resources and services among members without looking to profit or expecting anything in return. I started Reno Sparks Mutual Aid on March 16th as a way to link people in need of help, resources, and information as COVID-19 approached Nevada. We don't allow things to be sold for a price, and we respect social distancing with porch pickups and drop-offs. We have a retired employee from the State Department of Employment providing guidance to people filing UI claims. We've arranged birthday card mailings for kiddos without parties. As of May 4th, there are over 4,400 people in the group now. We've seen people donating their entire stimulus checks to help others and people who have next to nothing sharing with those who don't have anything. Our group may have started with the pandemic, but it won't end there. As a community, we will continue caring for one another rather than forcing individuals to fend for themselves. That's what we're about. I'm Megan Simons and you're my neighbor. Come join us. are the heart of the community and we want to share with you some of the inspirational messages that so many of you sent in. We couldn't be more proud of who you are, what you do, and what you give here at the City of Reno. Two years ago, over 10,000 residents came and joined us at the Greater Nevada Field to celebrate our 150th birthday. And tonight we're celebrating with you for our 152nd birthday, but it kind of gives you an idea and a sense of how resilient a city can be. We wanted to make sure that we celebrated. We also wanted to make sure that it's something that you know we are so proud to call Reno home. Happy birthday to our biggest little city. From the Western Railroads to the mining, agriculture, and now our technological times, you have always persevered. You provided the great outdoors to those who seek crisp, fresh air. You've given the urban cowboys a neon range of entertainment and a way of life. And now, even during some of the most challenging times in our history, you provide a hope for the future. The roar from Greater Nevada Field will be louder than ever and we will find solace together as a community through sports. We can't wait for that.
that day. But today on your birthday, we wish you and the residents of the 775 a truly happy and safe birthday. With love from your Reno Aces and Reno 1868 FC. I want to make sure I thank all of my council members. Each of you have done an incredible job during this difficult time, so thank you. And last but not least, our incredible citizens here at the City of Reno. Thank you for all you do. And Reno, thank you for staying strong. Together, we are strong. Protecting our frontline staff and first responders. For staying safe. For staying home. For practicing social distancing and being kind to one another. We're right in this with you, and we're all in it together. Thank you for joining us, everyone. We hope that this message leaves you with strength and inspiration. We know it's been an incredibly difficult time, and we recognize that. But thank you for staying strong, Reno. Thank you for all you do, and thank you to all of our citizens. Tonight, we want to make sure we light up the sky in honor of you. Thank you, Chris Sewell and Jam Pro Music Factory. We appreciate you donating this incredible beacon of light. All right, Reno, here we go in three, two, one. Happy birthday, Reno. Be kind and God bless. Thank you.